What's up everybody, it's Justin here with All Things Outdoors. Today I am doing a test run of the Butt Troll Kayak Seat Upgrade. Today I am doing a test run of the Bud Troll Kayak Seat Upgrade. So basically it is like a fold out deck chair that goes on top of your sit on top kayak. I mean these things are a dime a dozen here in Australia, they're everywhere and they usually come with a little uh, foam seat that you sit in down inside the top of the kayak. Which as many know, if you've spent any amount of time sitting in a sit on top kayak, your butt gets pretty numb after a while, so the geniuses at Bud Troll came up with this universal seat upgrade that allows you a lot more comfort. And it also sits you up a bit higher off the, off the deck of the kayak, which makes it considerably easier to get in and out of the kayak itself. If you know, as many of you know that have sit on top of kayaks, it's quite hard to get down into them and then up out of them because they're so low. So this is a far more comfortable option. And the beauty of them is that they're a universal fit, so they can fit any type of sit on top kayak that are usually only designed for those little folding foam seats. I'm back using the Kikes to Fish Barracuda today because I thought it would be a good kayak to try it out on. Now my first impression is that the Kikes to Fish Barracuda, which is a really stable kayak that I've been using for a number of years now, is just a slight bit more tippier than what it normally is. It's quite a wide kayak. But the thing about this Bud Troll seat upgrade is that it sits you up a good two to three inches higher than what you normally would be sitting in this kayak. Therefore, raising the center of gravity. And if you know anything about the center of gravity, the higher the center of gravity is, the more unstable the craft becomes. But this is a really stable kayak to start with, so it doesn't impact on it too much. Now I think the real test of this seat will be, will be to take it on a day trip or an overnighter, which I plan to do. And that will be the real test to see how the comfort, what, see what the comfort factor is like on an extended trip. But the good thing is you can really set it and lead it back and just have a nice leisurely paddle. Another good thing I've noticed too, being a little bit higher up out the water, Gives you a bit of view into the water as well when you're fishing. I'm here on my local waterway today, the King River, which is only walking distance from my house. And it's generally a very murky piece of water. But it's, it's relatively clear today for King River standards. I did a kayak trip back in February of this year. 
during a thunderstorm and managed to snap the blade of a paddle. And as you can see, I haven't managed to replace it yet. But I will be replacing it prior to my next trip, which is coming up in two weeks' time. Now the thing that makes this bike seat universal is that it's got a couple of little scupper plugs that fit into the scupper holes in the seat and it's got a couple of feet at the front and a big bar at the back that sits into the, the seat imprint on the sit on top kayak. Then it's got adjuster straps down the side which help you to adjust the angle of the, the seat back. And it's also got a couple of little clasps that hook into the original eyelets that hold those original foam seats on. So, and it's all fully adjustable, so you can adjust it for the, the widths that the uh, scupper holes are apart to fit into those scupper holes. And that's basically what uh, takes the weight of the, the seat and the person sitting in, obviously. And it also gives it a bit of cushion because those little scupper plugs are made out of like a high density foam. So my initial thoughts on this seat is that yes it's really comfortable for the, the 10 or 15 minutes that I've been out in the water here but the real test will be as I said before on a day long or an overnight trip. I have felt that the, the bar at the back here is sort of touching the, the back of my, my, the small of my back and that may get irritating over a while I might have to see if I can adjust it so that I don't have to feel that anymore. but it already has so many more benefits over the previous seat, the seat that it comes with. Probably the biggest one is that you don't get as wet. You're not sitting down in the seat, uh, water can come up through the scupper holes or it's obviously coming over the sides and it tends to gather down in that uh, bowl that is the seat. So I can see for one, I'm gonna be a hell of a lot drier as well, which is a massive bonus, I mean, you know, you could uh, go out and do trips in the water's a bit cooler and stay drier. So make sure you keep an eye out for my next kayak camping adventure video, which will be coming up in a few weeks. We're we'll doing a upper portion of the Ovens River, uh, looking for hopefully to fish for some trout, and we'll give this seat a really good test then. As always like and subscribe make sure you like the video it helps the uh, uh, youtube to to rate the video and grade it and then insert it into people's feeds and hit us up for a subscribe too that'd be really great guys helps the channel and uh yeah have a great day thanks for watching see you later